Well, Dolly Parton has further solidified her status as a legend. Listen to this. Guinness <laughs> World Records reports yeah. the star took home three new records. These include the longest span of number one hits on the U.S. Country Albums Chart, most studio albums released by a female country singer, and most top ten entries on the U.S. Country Albums Chart. Now this puts Dolly at a total of ten Guinness World Records. Parton is gearing up to add even more, by the way, with the upcoming release of her album Rockstar, which comes out on November 17th. I can't wait to hear that. I know. A lot of, of people it. are looking forward to it. Uh, speaking of Dolly, Knoxville's third annual festival honoring the Queen of Country starts back up tomorrow. It's called Dolly Fest, what used to be called that. Mm -hmm. Now it's Rhinestone Fest, which is a great fit as well. It runs all weekend in the Old City. People who go are asked to dress up in their Dolly best for a weekend of art, music, history, food, and fun. I mean, you need to dress. Yes, you do. Like Dolly. Yes, you do. And everything begins with the fourth annual Dolly Art Contest and Dolly Party, which will uh, be part of Knoxville's monthly First Friday activities. Then on Saturday, there will be a Dolly Costume Contest, a talent show, a full lineup of performers on stage along West Jackson Avenue. And then finally on Sunday, there's a special edition rhinestone market oh, highlighting, yes. <laughs> highlighting local and regional artists and makers displaying their Dolly-themed creations. You've got to check it out. You know, and